More now on the man killed in the Waianae shooting, Chad Duran. He was 32 years old. Growing up, he had been a standout football player at Waianae High School. But after high school, he had run-ins with the law. As KITV4's Marissa Yamane reports, Duran was released from prison about six months ago. Marissa. That's right, Mika. The Department of Public Safety told us Duran was released from prison just last September after serving less than half of his 20-year sentence for manslaughter. Tonight, we look back at that case. It was September 12, 2012. 26-year-old Christopher Medeiros was shot in the face in Makaha in his apartment on Lahaina Street. He died a day later. The man who shot him was Chad Duran, a family friend. Duran confessed to the crime after he was found a few blocks from the scene. He was arrested for murder but ended up pleading guilty to the lesser charge of manslaughter, saying he brought a loaded gun to Medeiros' home and that the gun went off during a dispute. Medeiros' girlfriend was pregnant at the time of the shooting and she spoke in court during Duran's sentencing on June 25, 2013. By that time, her baby was three months old. I got to raise my kid on my own because the choices you guys made. My son will never, ever know what a father is. His first year was supposed to be Chris and that will never, ever happen. My son not going to ever hear his voice or feel his touch. You can't even look at him. Duran also spoke during the sentencing. I never meant to hurt anybody and I'm sorry because I'm not a bad person. And, and, uh, and I know something has happened and somebody passed away. And I'm so from the bottom of my heart because I never meant for any of that to happen. Duran was sentenced to 20 years in prison with credit for time served. He had previously been arrested in 2010 for promoting dangerous drugs and was initially put on hope probation but had been in and out of jail for violating the terms of his probation. He had been on hope probation at the time of the 2012 shooting. Despite being sentenced by a judge to 20 years, he was released from Waiava Correctional Facility after serving only nine years. A spokesperson for the Hawaii Department of Public Safety told us, in 2013, the Hawaii Paroling Authority set Chad Duran's minimum term at nine years. He was paroled on September 15, 2021. On February 23, 2022, HPA issued a parole revocation warrant for failure to comply with the terms and conditions of his parole release. Flash forward to Tuesday morning shooting in Waianae. Police said Duran fired the first shot and the person he shot at returned fire, killing him. And as for that man who shot Duran, I asked the prosecutor's office if it's being considered self-defense. A spokesman told me they have not made any charging decisions regarding that portion of the case and it's still under active investigation. Marissa Yamane, KITV4 Island News.